Hey YouTube, I'm here to do video on my Riley. Forgive me if I feel, if I sound a little breathless. I did not use a mask yesterday while cleaning my uh, guinea pig cage and my goodness, I'm allergic to the hay. It was stupid of me and my lungs feel this small. They're probably, they're probably really small, but smaller than this. Anyway, um, let's get through this video without coughing. I, it'll hit me on the bus, I'll tell you that. It never fails. Get in an enclosed public place and the cough comes out. Anyway, to my Riley. Uh, I got it for Christmas. In sale. Um, I got it through my SA, Mr. Brandon. And um, it was actually sold out online. And he found it uh, for me in some random store. <laughs> and it was shipped. And I love it. A lot of you have asked me to um, uh, show how I did this strap. Now, the bag comes with, you know, I hate these little skinny straps that do nothing for the bag. So it came with this. And what I did was, there's a stitch that held the strap together. Let me take it off. So let's see how this was. It was a stitch that held I can't remember which which way it was. Basically, it held the strap together. I just cut the thread. I just cut the thread. Uh, if I ever change my mind, I can just go back to, you know, a cobbler or whatever and have them stick it back on. So I didn't damage the strap. I just hate these straps. They just don't do anything for me. So I was able to free up the chain part that comes with that strap and attach, my husband did, I think I have a video of him doing it until he almost took off his finger. <laughs> he stabbed himself, poor guy. All right, and then squeeze together, I guess. So this ring was attached to this. Yeah, I'm sorry. I should have actually taken a picture of it before I mangled it. But as soon as I got the bag, I was like, oh, okay. How? Was, oh, yes. Okay. These two pieces, these two rings, I opened up or my husband opened up because they were attached here. So you can probably see it because it's not really done that well. Those two pieces, that, see how it opens? And then this right here, see how it opens? We opened it, took it off of here, and then attached those two pieces to this part and just squeezed them shut. I'm going to go to the Coach store and see if one, and they've did, done it for, for me before, if they have um, new D-rings, and see if they'll attach it to me, uh, attach it for me the right way, <laughs> make it a little prettier. It is slightly scratchy. So what I'm gonna do is file it down a little bit if the, if the coach door won't do it. So just, just so it won't scratch the bag. Um, it hasn't, so that's on my list of things to do. Uh, if I could, my essays and uh, the coach house, they'll do it for me they'll just put on separate D-ring. So I hope I explained that properly. All I did was open up, snip the, snip the thread, open up the D-ring, put it around this, squeezed, and that's how I got the chain to look like this. It's not hard. It's, you'll, if you, if you get the bag, if you have the bag, you can kind of see what I mean, because quite frankly, I'm not that eloquent this morning. <laughs> and it gives me an option to wear the bag like this, you know, like that, or of course, to just let it dangle. And then I had purchased the um, extra strap that goes perfectly with this bag. Um, I'm not sure if this sale is still on, but everything here was on sale and I love this bag. At first, 
I think a couple of months ago, Brandon uh, sent me a picture of it. And he was like, oh, do you like this bag? I was like, eh, no, it's not really doing anything to me. Boy, did I eat my words. When I went in the store and I saw it, it was gorgeous. Gorgeous. 1941. Oh, and look what I did. This is why those of us who are lucky to get to a coach store, find an essay that you like and they will hook you up. Look at the, look at the hang tag. Ah, it's the snake skin on the back. How well does that match? If you remember my last video, I got the tabby, the black tabby, and I felt this tabby should have been 1941. And that little flimsy, you know, the little flimsy um, leather coach fob that comes with it. I was like, eh, let me go to the coach store and see if they have an extra one. They did. They had this one. So she gave it to me um, and I put it on the tabby. But when I got this bag, I mean, the colors are perfect. So I put the key fob, the, the key fob that comes with this is your 1941, but it's just plain black with the gold. But I thought that one matched even better than this. And if I lose this, I'm gonna cry, but I shouldn't. So anyway, back to the bag. Beautiful uh, glove tanned leather, very easily scratched. So you gotta watch it. The brass um, handle is just stunning. And I was in Zara the other day Apparently, Louis Vuitton has a bag that looks just like this. This girl was wearing it. And I was like, that looks like my um, my Riley. I think it's the, I can't remember the name of the Louis Vuitton one. In which case, I don't care. She paid thousands of dollars for hers. And I paid next to nothing for my all leather bag. This has the new uh, Coach logo. I don't know if it's new, but it's, you know, the horse and carriage logo. Magnet. Beautiful, beautiful uh, maroon. Um leather interior and let's take out this i have not worn this yet i'm debating on whether i'm going to wear it today um i don't know if this bag is still available but you can always uh hit my essay up brandon on instagram i'll put his info below um and he can try and find it for you but the inside here is canvas which I'm not, I wish they would have made an all leather bag, but whatever. Canvas, canvas, canvas. You have a zipper, middle part, canvas is the stuff that comes with it. Um, and so, yeah. I have not played with her yet to see what fits. So I'm going to do that now with you guys. And there is no pocket on the back. So let's see what fits. I... I've uh, been wearing my gray rogue. Let's see if everything that's in here <laughs> will fit in here. I have my Louis Vuitton, I think this is Emily wallet. Does a full size wallet fit in here? No, it does not. And I'm not going to force it. You see, full size wallet. Well, it does fit. It actually does fit, um, kinda. I don't see the point, so I'm gonna take that out. Does not fit for me. Uh, a card case will do just fine. This was in there, I'm not even gonna bother. That's not gonna fit. This is the full size um, Pouchette Essessoir. Um, ah, <laughs> my little earbud case, my owl case, of course, that'll fit in. Uh, my Louis Vuitton round coin purse. Of course, well, that'll fit. Bus pass holder, of course, that'll fit. Um, Coach Cave uh, card holder, obviously, that'll fit. An iPhone 8. Um, that will either fit anyway, that'll fit in there. My regular phone is the XR, which will easily fit in there. I'm filming on it now. And, it cl and I still haven't even put in anything in the uh, middle apartment. Let's say I wanted to throw in some gum, uh, lip balm, and maybe a lippy. Of course, that all fits in there nicely. Room to spare. It expands a little bit, but I'm not going to completely full her up. And she closes quite nicely, quite easily. Nice weight, and it's a perfect... The bag is absolutely adorable. I love it. Um, 
Again, I believe it's still on sale if you want to try and find it. Uh, looked at, look down at Brandon's information below, contact him and he may be able to find um, the bag for you. It is absolutely stunning. And especially with this strap, stunning. The strap I think is still available online. One of you ladies had asked me to compare it to my Dinky 19 and it is smaller. As you can see, the Dinky 19 fits in front of it and it's smaller. It's thinner as well. Um, yeah, this bag, you can only get one thing in each compartment. So. Ooh, what's this? Yeah, one phone will fit in here. My second phone will not. Let me see. Uh, but the tie-in, I'll show you. We finished. Let's see. Let's see if it closes. Oh yeah, it closes. So everything fits in here that fit in here. Obviously there's no room to spare in this one. Let's see. See everything fit in its own little compartment. And there will be there would be no room in this bag for my phone. I would either have to carry my phone or I would have to um, put it in my coat pocket or something. But everything that I just put in here does fit in the Dinky 19. The Dinky 19 is actually very hard to find. So I don't know <laughs> if you can get it on a resale site, maybe. So as you can see, the Dinky 19 is slightly smaller. This is the 22. I think it's a, I think it measures 22 inches. So it's true to size. So yeah. I hope that helps that comparison but both beautiful beautiful stunning bags and i just love the chain details the strap the wish coach would sell these thicker straps with these kind of bags Ugh. so that is my riley let me know if you guys have any questions or comments um highly recommend if you can find her this bag also comes in other colorways as well um I believe there's the signature, uh, white and black. Uh, yeah, there's a signature with the white piping and then there's a signature with the black piping. Um, but it really, and it comes in a smaller size um, in like this beautiful peacock blue. And they all come with the, the dual strap, like the strap that has this. So if you kind of wanted to do your own little project, um, I recommend it. I love, I love the way this looks. So yeah, um, let me know if you have any questions or comments below. Um, let me know what you think about her. And I will be talking to you in my next video.